had one uh, firefighter with a serious but non-life-threatening injury. Uh, fire operation like this, when you have fire, multiple fire, sorry about that. Uh, fire operation like this, when you have heavy fire on multiple floors of a building, uh, is time-consuming to, uh, uh, to extinguish. You have to stretch multiple hand lines uh, to each floor. Very dangerous operation for our firefighters. Uh, at the same time, while we're trying to extinguish the fire, they're conducting searches uh, on the floor with the heavy fire and above that. So, uh, 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 as I said, we removed three critically ill adults. So your total patient count was 16, is that right? Uh, we have 16. Uh, there were six uh, injured people from the fire building, uh, and the rest were from uh, adjoining buildings, uh, more minor injuries. Just to break it, there was one more, 17 total. 17, 17. total patients. Just one firefighter, I guess, right? Uh, one firefighter, yes, transported to the hospital. But minor. Uh, a serious injury, but non life threatening injury at this time. Smoke or? Uh, yeah, he's being evaluated, we're not sure. Okay. Nobody died there, right? Uh, the, the critically injured patients were, were treated on the scene and transported to the hospital. Very good. Any other questions? And thank you, Chief. Thanks thank you, a lot, Chief. guys. Thank you.